right. <laughs> Day three, bitches. Here I am on a fucking roll. I'm um, about to head into therapy. Haven't filmed a goddamn thing today. Um, I just basically was cleaning and went to school and working on an essay. And now I've got this and I've got at least one more errand to run tonight. So I'm just running around. About to go see my therapizer for the first time in like a month. Um, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what happens. What? What up? Just got out of therapy. I actually feel really, I feel really good. You know, let's just take a moment here to talk about therapy. Even if you go in and you, and you don't know what to talk about, you don't, there, for me, a lot of times it's like, there are so many things I could talk about, but none of them are really like relevant right now like yeah I'm stressed about school or yeah like I've got this thing going on with this person or what you know whatever the fuck it is and you're like this isn't for, for me it's like I don't even want to do this it's not worth it it's the same it is the same as working out honestly like going and just talking with somebody that you trust about anything or everything it's in letting letting yourself it's about letting yourself let go of the need to hold it all in it doesn't matter if your entire entire town is just fucking burnt down or if you're bummed out about a grade like anything it doesn't matter the purpose of the thing is to talk about it so that it's not <sighs> building inside and you and you know you're not gonna fucking pop out on somebody because shit that person's about to pop out on someone um it the the whole point that i'm trying to make is that it is beneficial it's going to help and it doesn't have to even be a therapist you know i've learned that if you need to talk call your mom or call your best friend or talk to your coworker or go out and fucking get a drink and talk to a stranger. And it doesn't have to be about whatever the fuck you have going on in your head constantly. Sometimes you can just have a conversation with somebody and feel better because you know that you're not alone anymore. You know that it's not just you feeling stuck inside your head or feeling like you are about to fucking explode because you have so much shit to get done or feeling, you know, isolated and worried. Other people are also going through these things. And I think the whole part about it is relatability. The great thing about a therapist though, is that they're impartial and they're there just for you. So if you're like me and your parents never talked to you about anything, um, finding somebody who is interested in what you have to say and invested in who you are is one of the most groundbreaking things for developing like a solid identity post trauma that that got deep nobody needs to know that much about me on the internet but you know that's kind of what what this is also for me i just get to i just get to talk to you slash me when i go back and rewatch this it's it's liberating so much of my life was just spent isolated and not being able to talk about anything with anybody and then growing up when I actually needed to learn how to talk about things with people and to relate to people it was hard it's like a struggle it's been me working all the time at being able to relate to people and not go somewhere else in my head when they're trying to like have a conversation with me and not only relate to people but <clears throat> add value to the conversation and make people feel good. And I've always been the person that, you know, that people come to when they need to talk about something because I'm always the type of person that listens, but I've, you know, oh God, for a second I couldn't see. Um, but I have just, I'm, I'm now learning how to like also talk to people about things and it's a positive thing. If somebody tells you that you shouldn't be adding your own life experiences and like what you think and your relations into a conversation, tell them to go fuck themselves because they're not a real friend. 
that that's my rant. Thank you for coming to my TikTok. TikTok? Not TikTok. She loves him. I'm not sure the feeling is mutual. Oh, there we go. It is. Are you guys dancing? Are you dancing? Wow. 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 Hello, you two. What are you doing on the counter? Okay, quick update. I'm making myself leftover dinner because I made a full dinner last night and I have to eat leftovers, so. Uh, and I spent $22 today at Goodwill and I found almost all of the props that I need for my photo shoot that's coming up. And I think that I might be able to just make or find the rest of the props that I need. Um, so probably in the next couple of days, I'll show you that and like talk about what I'm trying to do. I don't think I've talked about the photo shoot coming up in any of these videos yet, but you're gonna be seeing a lot more of that because that's what I have going on this week. Um, that was my update. My food is done, so I'm gonna go pour a lot of ketchup all over my potatoes. What up? I have to do this laying down because I have a kitty. I have an kitty cat. She's right here, making herself. And kitty. Miss Lou, where are you? Miss Lou. <clears throat> we had the other boy over there. It's my baby chilling. And I'm just here to say goodnight. I'm hoping I will sleep better tonight. And I'm hoping that everything tomorrow will go good. Um, and by me saying that out loud, I'm putting it into the universe. Ready? Into the universe. Into the universe. Anyway. I almost forgot about this, too. I almost forgot. But I didn't forget. That's the important thing. I've got to get up early in the morning and go to paradise and get coffee and go shoot some stuff for a class at a church with a bunch of people working out. I doubt, mm, I doubt I'll shoot anything for this there because I don't know, I don't have permission. Maybe just like, maybe just not of people, but I don't know, I don't know, we'll see. Now I'm just talking, new me. Do you want to drink out of my cup? Do you want to take a sip from the goblet? Are you going to go to the Triwizard Tournament? Hmm? Going to go fight the wagons? It's like probably too dark to even see her. <laughs> She's so dark. Um, okay. Vlogmas, day three. Go me. Yay.